It's been a busy week for high school basketball, so we have a lot of postseason magic plays to look at. But first, of course, we have to look at this week's QMG Play of the Week winner, and that is South Shelby's Cameron Mitchell. Watch Cameron take it down low, fighting through contact. She just shoots her shot, and it pays off with two plus the foul. Going to miss seeing her playing for that South Shelby team. Now let's take a look at this week's nominees. Watch Camp Point Central's Gavin blew it. Get the rebound, tip the ball away from his defender, and then hustles to keep the play alive. I know Gavin didn't make that shot, but the hustle to keep the play alive is so impressive. Let's check out Quincy Hyde's Bradley Longcore the third in the sectional semis with 1.7 seconds left. He beats the buzzer with a floater three. This was to go in a halftime, but anytime you can beat the buzzer, you gotta love that feeling. And he was feeling it after he made that shot. Now this next nominee didn't have one specific play, but Hannibal's Mariah Mayfield balled out Wednesday night. She hit seven threes, which breaks the school record, and she dropped 27 points in this game. Huge accomplishment for Miss Mayfield. And our last nominee is McCombs Ian Case. Watch him take it down low, pushing his defender off and finishing with a one-hand fadeaway shot. I mean, that's how you win the sectional, people. Great play there from Ian Case. Those are your QMG nominees. As always, be sure to log on to WGM.com sports to cast your vote.